when i'm sourcing for the tile sana sana mimi nataka ku involve client sana because when you sourcing for the tile kila mtu akona test yake you can, you can find the client mwenye akona test ya 30 by 30 na kuna mwingine akona test ya 60 by 60 unaona so it goes a long way when you're working hand in hand with the client wakati una source hizo tiles so mostly wakati na source tiles i i take time i take time si hakuna kurush hakuna nini unless nimepata hiyo tile ambayo ime glance ama ime strike at one point and then from then I go for it but in most cases i prefer sana when i'm doing the i'm sourcing for the tiling ni take time ni take time go source for the tiling look for the best tiling uh, and then from there share with the client then we agree ni gani na na but mostly in most cases i can advise people to use tile ambayo ni 40 by 40 40 by 40 ina go a long way na pia inatoa space yake inatoka vizuri kidogo as compared to tile ya 30 by 30 iko slightly smaller however kuna watu wanatumia ga 30 by 30 kwa nyumba you never you can never go wrong with your own style you know you can never go wrong with your own style but i prefer tile ya 30 ya 40 by 40 tile ya 40 by 40 spacing yake ni kubwa si kubwa sana ni kama medium it's like medium way way than, and, and it's somehow better na nzuri tu kwa kutumia so wakati nafanya sourcing ya tile wa, na prefer sana ku source tiles from such ceramics ama ideal ceramics sana sana size ceramics the reason why is because these tiles are such na ideal they are from egypt you know tiles are egypt they are steady stronger as compared to tiles za za kenyan tile ya fly kwa biashara build kenya buy kenya build kenya bono snow tiles za kenya yes ni tiles nzuri tu we will buy kenya and build kenya but tiles za egypt they are more better and good cost as compared to za china na zetu za hapa kenya but we are still buying Kenya and building Kenya <laughs> because hii nyumba iko wapi hii ni Kenya <laughs> tujaenda ku build elsewhere anyway so mostly tell the saja can advise someone if you are working unajua the, the key factors that most clients wana consider wakati wanatakunua tiling ni the quality na mfuko yake according to my experience sana sana client wengi u consider mfuko so uki consider mfuko sana utaenda up kubai tiles za Kenya those are those are trifold mostly na za China there are some tiles pia zinatoka China but never ku advice because tiles za China ni from my experience was na fade sana hata za Kenya was na fade sana with time si lazima kukuwa na traffic kwa hiyo nyumba ama watu wanacheza neno but they fade with time wakati utaosha na bleach chemicals sana sana uki bleach wash unajua kuna chemicals na kwa specifically to wash tiles but kuna client wanaweza tumia bleach so sometimes ukitumia bleach tiles za Kenya was na fade sana as compared to Egypt. So I will advise such ceramic tiles out natoka Egypt na ziko juu na you can go there and source your tiles from. Kama hizi yenye nimetumia hapa I source them from such ceramics. They are slightly expensive but you get value of your money. Quality is key. Tile patterns can manipulate the visual appearance of a space making it appear more taller or wider in a room. That's why most cases nikifanya tiling I highly I highly love doing uh, diagonal style. Most fundis wana claim kwamba diagonal style it takes more tiles na inakuwa na kukata kwingi. Of course kuna kukata kwingi but based on my experience Diagonal tile as yendangi tiles mingi as compared to kika straight ama max pattern hapana. Ni vile tu mafundi wengi ni waoga kufanya hiyo style na wataki kazi ngumu. Unajua kazi ngumu ndio inatoa kazi safi. So <laughs> fundi anakuambia hapana tufanye hii ya kawaida tu ndio tiles zaenda mingi ndio usiwe style mingi. I will show you the west zenye ni main car wakati nimefanya this design ya, 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 ya diagonal tile kwa ma, ma, di, 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 this particular project i show you zile zile west nime nime, nime up ni kidogo sana ni, ni kidogo sana eh, all in all hata ukiweka straight math pattern utakata two tile so sometimes i highly prefer kufanya diagonal because it makes a space more looks more authentic looks more learned spin <laughs> you know kana imeenda shule sana so kindly if you want to do tiling kindly consider me i'm an expert in this field and i don't let you down i'll do it the right way right spacing kila kitu
also highly prefer kutumia tile ya 30 by 60 kwa ukuta the client was for, for an idea to tumie tile ya uh, tile ndogo but nika advise kwamba tile kubwa kama ya 30 by 60 it makes the house look wider neater presentable nicer unaona ina inafanya kazi inaenda haraka inakuwa unaona vizuri sana you highly notice makosa wakati tile ni kubwa as compared to tile ikikuwa ndogo so mostly ninapendanga tile ikikuwa kubwa when the kitchen is wider but when the kitchen is tiny and smaller then i can advise you to go kwa tiling for example 33 by 45 but in this case i highly preferred kutumia tile ya 30 by 60 it makes the, the kitchen looks more presentable nicer as compared to when you are using a smaller tile in this kitchen Pia nilikuwa nataka at least kufanya kitu ambazo ni slightly different si kutaka kutumia the same same tile ambayo nimetumia kwa kule of hapa chini ni tumie kwa skirting na border so i, I think i, I went along uh, buying uh, this black tile ina inakaa poa sana the shade black iko na goldish in it sprinkle gold nilinibamba tu sana nikasema let me go for this ni tumie kwa border kwa mipaka ya hiyo nyumba na pia kwa skirting inatoka kazi safi sana you know interior design bana si lazima ufanye vitu tu za kama ni tiling upige tiling hivyo hivyo the client is not aware i think the client is also seeing this for the first <laughs> time but nilimwambia mimi nikifanya kazi zangu wa mostly nataka utafauti fulani yani it's not just common kwamba weka tile ndio hivyo piga diagonal at least spice so your tile nimeitumia hapo kama spice is spice up is tile zingine at least ilete uzuri mzuri ilete irembeshe nyumba vile vile tiles are porcelain most cases was na kuanga slippery sana na i can highly advise someone to use them in an office setting ama hall ambayo ni kubwa as compared kutumia kwa home setting kama sahi home ilikuwa na steps kadhaa so i advise the client kwamba tiles are porcelain kama hao yako si flat na si, si iko na steps don't use that tile. Umesikia kuna sometimes there were a lot of cases za tile death. Yaani watu wanakufa kupitia tiles za nyumba. Akitileza kidogo kama kuna maji, kama tile ya porcelain ukiweka kwa nyumba. <laughs> Lazima ukwati na mop nyumba uko unapiga magoti. Uko unapiga magoti otherwise aisikizani na maji sana inakuwa slippery, inaweza kuwa. So the kind of tile tumetumia hapa tunaita half ceramic, half porcelain. Unaona half ceramic half porcelain digital iko katikati hapo na, uh, na si, si haitelezi na si rough nini ceramic ceramic uh, they, they are good mostly sababu huwa azitelezi na ziko sawa you can still wash nyumba hata na aerial ama na omo na uwezi uwezi pasuka kichwa ukiwa umesimama but porcelain <laughs> but remember you can never go wrong with your own style tile grouting in most cases we are tile grouting if the tiles are white kama sasa tunatumia white tiles on the walls tunatumia grouting ya white but sana sana wakati eh, tiling ni ni white na kuna shade ya black para, sana sana kwa flooring wana prefer sana kutumia gray because gray ishiki uchafu haraka na ichafuki haraka but you can also use uh, tile ya white uh, grouting ya white chini but i can advise uh, from my own experience tile ya white ni grouting ya white wao inachafua sana ukitumia chini but when you use a uh, gray grout chini uh, it's good to go you you good to go at least haitachafuka sana na itakaa sana so uh, another thing uh, nye, nye, at least nge advise for my clients kwamba food has kudanganya kwamba tumia cement as grout you know grout has got higher water density ratios compared to cement so grout huwa inatumika ina, ina sana ku fill in the joints hapo katikati those joints and also eco waterproof as compared to cement so zile joints katikati pale ina compact vizuri inafanya nini kusikuwe na maji maji si leak kwa tiling pale kwa chini so that making it better to use grout unlike kutumia simiti kufilizo the the spaces in between the tiles wakati tumeka spaces up so go, go for grout mtu asikudanganya tutumia simiti hiyo itakuwa kazi chafu kidogo msafi interior design we are not associated with that job nafanya kazi safi mambo yangu haya
thank you so much for watching part four of this video tomorrow we are doing now the final touches final touches kufunga socket siza ukuta make sure kwamba cleanness hapo kwa makabati kufanya cleanness kabisa kama kuna uchafu yote to clean to toe kabisa alafu there is something that i want to do here yeah, starting to explain sai that is unique that i want i was telling you that it will itakuwa unique so tomorrow we, we 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 are cleaning up hopefully by sato or sunday we are going to reveal the whole project and reveal the features the kitchens and everything thank you so much for watching this video be blessed kindly subscribe to my youtube channel Kiamsofi interior design mambo yangu haya thank you